guys, welcome back to a brand new ASOS haul. This is gonna be a bit of an ASOS haul slash holiday what I packed haul. As you can see, I'm in a very, very different surrounding. I'm currently in the Maldives. I know a lot of you probably saw that on Snapchat, Instagram and everywhere else. But I really wanted to film the haul from here and sort of show you almost around the island a little bit as I try on all of the things. So first of all, I'm just gonna show you what I got from ASOS to kick this off. I got this really sweet pair of Sandals, I've worn these quite a few times. They are really comfortable. That lovely, sweet, lacy pattern with these little butterflies on there. It has rose gold straps and then these silver straps go up your legs. But they're just really, really comfortable. What size do I get these in? I got these in a size, sort of a half size bigger for me, just so they'd be really, really snug and comfy. But yeah, I thought they were really gorgeous. Those are the bats, if you're wondering what that noise is. So this is one of my favourite things that I brought actually. It's a Sea Sucker print, like a striped peach and cream print all the way throughout fabric. And it's just one of those very low necks and it goes all the way around to the back as well. So it's low at the back, low at the front. I've tried quite a lot of these swimsuits and in the past they've always kind of like shown my boobs, my boobs have popped out of them or something. But these are actually really quite comfortable. I don't feel that unsecure in this. It's just a really gorgeous, really flattering swimsuit. I love the colour. Ooh, another favourite actually. This is so beautiful. It's got a bit of a kaftan meets sarong meets long floaty dress feel. It's a bit of everything. It's the kind of thing I'd throw on over a bikini in the same way I would a kaftan. It's just really stunning. I've been wearing this over like a gorgeous blue Melissa Odavash bikini that I'm going to show you next. And it just really sets off the colours and it just fits perfectly over that area. So you can just see a little bit of your bikini poking out. But with these cap sleeves and the long length and the way it's cut into three sections so it kind of just flows in the wind and it's really, really flattering. It's a really great piece. If you're going away soon, I would highly recommend this. I've loved wearing this so much. Next up, I've got two jersey pieces, like a black jersey. They're just that very easy piece to throw on, whether it's sort of casual or an evening with a pair of heels. First one being this halter neck. It ties around the back as well and it's the kind of thing you can throw on over a bikini and just feel really secure in it it's a nice length i wore this on a boat trip the other day and just felt really pretty in it nice easy piece and then this one actually is my favorite i've been wearing this so much and again it's black jersey material this feels a little bit thicker than the last one actually but it's got these gorgeous pom-poms running down the armholes so this gives a bit more texture, it's quite fun and cute. Again, into these shorts that aren't too tight, so it's just really free, really kind of easy to wear. It also looks quite flattering when you wear it. You can, again, you can wear it with heels, you can wear it with flats and just dress it up or down. But a more evening piece that I think will be perfect for your autumn wardrobe, not just for like holidays or late holidays, is this gorgeous play suit. Again, this is just like ASOS own, but it's a almost a turquoise teal fabric underneath this black lace. It just sort of shows through this very deep green with the two different tones. It's got mesh, it's got a higher neck, comes around the back with a zip and then fastens at the back of the neck. It's got a bit of a keyhole and then it's long sleeve. I just felt really pretty wearing this. I just thought it was really flattering. It's a good length for a play suit and it's quite covering as well for like colder nights. Over here it's been great, but this is the kind of thing I will wear back in London over autumn and into winter really. Just as kind of like a going out piece. Next, I got this towel because I thought just in case there weren't any towels here and I wanted something a bit cuter to sit on the beach in. I got this towel, black and white Aztec print. It has fringing around the edges. It's just one of those cool round towels that were kind of quite hype last year, I remember, but I just really, really wanted one for this trip. I thought it was lovely. I also got this bikini, which is just under here. Quickly show you. I've been wearing this loads. It's a gorgeous kind of peachy tone. It's got a ribbed patterning. It's really quite flattering on my little boobs as well, so I quite like it. And it just goes down into normal little string bikini bottoms but I thought this was gorgeous and they also do this in lots of different types of styles it's almost a mix and match style they're doing at the moment so you can get it in bikini style balcony halter neck and a few different types of bottoms as well but I thought I'd show you that and last but not least I got an inflatable pineapple <laughs> can you see yeah, so I really wanted something fun to bring for like pictures, thought it'd be really cute. And I've seen so many people with these inflatable things. So I went for the pineapple. We blew it up ourselves, we didn't need anyone else to blow it up. For us, like you sometimes to do because they're so big. But it's just been really nice to have, quite fun for kind of in the pool and in the sea. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. 
Okay, so a few more things that I brought with me. These red heels, I didn't really bring any other heels apart from these. And these are from Next. Next, this season, I'm really killing it when it comes to accessories. I think I've said this before, but their accessories this season, especially heels, are so gorgeous. And these are beautiful. They're a cherry red. They've got a great set of straps that cover the leg. So it's really flattering. A nice strap over your foot. Just a really gorgeous pair of shoes. So I packed those for the trip. I've been looking for this pair of sandals for so long. They've been sold out everywhere. I finally found them before I came away and I thought, Seeing as I've been wanting them so much, I'll treat myself and get a pair. And these are by Elena Linadaki, a Greek designer, I think. They've been so hyped this whole summer with this whole pom-pom, lacy, sequin, beadwork. You know, there's so much going on with these shoes, but I really, really love them and I really wanted them. I mean, they're all kind of tangled here with all this colour and everything, but they're just gorgeous. So I got a pair of those as well. I brought a swimsuit with me. This one from Elspace. How gorgeous these colours and the white, orange, pastely orange and also mint green. I thought it was beautiful. I love the colours so much and it was just a beautiful style how it crosses over at the back and the whole back completely exposed. Just a really gorgeous style. I know I'm mixing this up, I'm just kind of picking everything up here. I also brought my self-portrait dress as my kind of evening piece. In fact, I brought two, but I thought I'd show you this one. This is gorgeous lace work on a nude backing, so it just looks really, it just looks like you're wearing a full lace body, really. It's beautiful. And I always feel really pretty when I wear this. I've got another bikini from Sea Folly. Dunning print all over this. It's tropical, blue and white, deep navy black print all over it and the same to the halter neck top. I don't often wear these halter neck tops, but I've really enjoyed wearing this and it's also double-sided, so you can also wear it stripy, which is kind of cool, because then you get two bikinis for one price, I guess. And another piece from Elspace that I really wanted just for more beach dresses to wear, because in the Maldives especially, you generally just wear beach dresses and bikinis most of the days, because it's just so hot. So I got this one from Elspace. It's a stunning print, just white, blue, I don't even know how to describe that print, but it's just a lot going on, it's quite busy. It's shorter at the front with the drape and then goes longer. These two bats have been like squabbling for days and we keep seeing them kind of up in trees. But yeah, so I really, really love that dress. I brought one key accessory with me, which was the Gucci Velvet Marmot bag. Hey, shut up, shut up, shut up. I brought one key accessory with me, the Gucci Marmot bag in the velvet green. Sorry about the bats, I just they've been going off so long that I want to carry on with this video. And it just goes with pretty much all the dresses that I brought, so I thought it was the perfect option. And another piece actually, this Melissa Odebash play suit. Again, it's just really light, really kind of billowy, it's not tight, so it doesn't kind of feel too much when it's so hot. But it's a great little cover up of bikinis, and it just goes down into a little pair of play suit shorts. So it ties around the waist to pull it in and then ties around here as well. So it's kind of a larger size, you can pull it in and make it how you like, but yeah, I really love it. And another bikini to show you is this one from Melissa Odebash. I wear a lot of Melissa Odebash's pieces, as I've mentioned a few here, but I just find they're just really feminine and flattering and quite sexy as well. And this one is in a blue reptile print with these gold pieces to each side, halter neck, and then the bottoms again with these gold pieces here and a full blue reptile print. I just felt really pretty wearing this. It really held me in in all the right places. Okay, I really think that's it actually. That's everything that I brought on holiday, everything that I hauled, and hopefully you've enjoyed seeing all the different try-ons. I'll leave some information down below about the hotel as well, for where we are in case you're interested. Um, I'll be doing loads of blog posts as well on the different hotels we've been to, so have a look at that as well on inthefro.com. And yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video as always, guys. If you did, then please give it a like. If you're new here, please do hit the subscribe button. I'll leave it right here, just click that. You'll be subscribed for two videos a week, Wednesday and Sunday. I would love to have you back. I usually don't look quite this sweaty and hot, and things are usually a lot more kind of chilled, but still, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye.